All right, this is D from Brooklyn. This is July 21st, and no, I'm not standing in a closet. All the power is out, thanks to Con Edison of New York, which is a bunch of jerks. Of course, with all the emergency preparation, battery backups, of course, battery-powered pumps are not working. You need batteries in order to operate battery-powered pumps. Luckily, I have the solar-powered pump which is a good thing I just got that one. The fish are hanging in there. It's not running all night, but this will be a video record. Hopefully I don't lose any fish. Hopefully we make it through. Got the kerosene lamps. Thanks to Mama Lorraine, keeping that prep in order, always keeping the kerosene lamps. It's stupid hot in here. 89 degrees. Apex is off. Everything is off. I'll keep this as an archive for good old Con Edison. Thank you, Con Edison. Bunch of jerks. Hi, peeps. This is D from Brooklyn Update. This is 5 o'clock the next day. And thank you all that emergency prep. I did have another battery backup. So my fishes are still alive. Let's give them the once over. I got about 50 flashlights. So my boys are still swimming. Coals hanging in there. And we shall see what we shall see. As I come into the basement, oh good, the rainbows are still hanging in there. The pump that I had on this one, of course, is not working. I had several emergency pumps. Only one of them was working. The solar power one is not working. And I cannot find the other one because it's dark as hell and I don't remember where I put it. Okay, let's take a look at the little frag system. Okay, that's not a good sign. He's still good, and so that is a good sign. Okay, I do see some swimming. That's a good sign. Corals aren't going to open up. Oh, I see something very upsetting. My Royal Gamma is dead. Now, that is extremely upsetting. Con Ed, screw you. You're going to pay me for this. All right, I had that one since he was really, really small. So that is really upsetting. I'm going to have to get him out of there. All right, okay, these guys are swimming. No pumps for these tanks. Everybody seems present and accounted for. And it's not so much the uh, filtration, but it is really hot. It's about 80. It's, it was feeling like 90 in Brooklyn yesterday. And the tank's really hot, so the aeration is the real issue. All right, the betas and my little baby rainbows are doing all right. I see them swimming. These guys should be all right because this is my super nano cichlid tank. Okay, I see the threadfin rainbows are swimming around in there. I don't see the baddest baddest, but I'm pretty certain if the rainbows are okay... They should be okay, but I'm really upset with this con, and I'm really upset with myself, actually, because the uh, contingency plan is not 100%. The emergency backup is as good as, as good as you keep it prepped. In other words, I had not been regularly checking those emergency pumps. And when I needed one of them, it was not working. So this is day two, July 28th. And I'm really upset with Con Edison in Brooklyn. Several of the areas, you know, Marine Park, Mill Basin, Flatbush, Canarsie, and several other areas are without power. This is day number two. And I'll keep you guys posted. Leave your comments below. Hopefully, if you're uh, in the same situation, get those D batteries, baby. Hopefully, you got some kind of backup plan. I got a uh, emergency 12-volt uh, uh, battery. And, of course, the bad thing, here's the most disappointing thing. I have the generator. The generator was full of really old gas, so it only ran for a little while. 
And then it cut off. So I'm going to have to try to get some gas today. Try to flush that old gas out of the generator and get it working. So, uh, yeah, I got a big old generator that's doing me no good right now. <laughs> it's, yep, those contingency plants are only as good as the one maintaining the contingency. This is D from Brooklyn. Got to run to work. Deal with that hustle now. Take it easy. I'll be all right. We always make out. Brooklyn people make out. Love, peace, and hair grease. I'm out. See ya. I'm definitely not going to feed these guys because I don't want them pooping or doing any more strenuous.